Hey guys, and welcome back. Today I'm talking about how your sitting posture can affect your squat and an easy mobility technique to loosen up your, your hamstrings to help with the squat and also take some pressure off your low back. So we've been talking about sitting and sort of posture over the last few weeks. So for example, if I'm sitting at my desk or chair and I'm tucking my feet underneath, what this is doing is shortening my hamstring. Okay, so your hamstrings are a group of muscles on the back side of your thigh that cross two joints, your knee and your hip. So if they're short, they're going to affect both of these joints. Most likely, this is going to affect you in a squat. So when you're doing your squat, an easy way to, to see if this is bothering you or not is to have a friend either look at your technique or use a mirror. And what you should be able to do, ideally, is keep that neutral spine all the way through the squat. Okay, if you're having any issues with mobility, your hamstrings may sort of pull your butt underneath because they anchor in the buttocks. Okay, so if I have height, uh, tight hamstrings, I'm getting squatting down, 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 and then I hit my limit, it's going to pull my buttocks underneath and round me through the spine. So the way you can fix this, an easy mobility technique is called a straight leg raise, and you can use a wall or pillar to do this stretch. So the way this is going to work, setup is important. You want to have your hips squared up to the wall. So I'm going to get right my buttocks right up against it or as close as I can. And my opposite leg, I'm keeping it flat down to the floor and my toe pointing straight up. Okay, so if I let it drop out, my hips going to do all kinds of funny things. I'm going to lose this stretch. So my bottom leg is flat to the floor, toe pointing to the ceiling. And with the leg I'm trying to stretch, give yourself a bit of slack, a bit of knee bend at the beginning. And you can just push that leg into the wall until you feel a nice big pull down the back side of your thigh. So remember the rule for stretching time, we're doing two minutes. What I typically like to do is after about 30 seconds, you get in closer to the wall. And once your buttocks is right up against it and your knee is flat, then you can go past but 90 degrees is a great starting point. So we'll set that as the goal for the next few weeks. Two minutes each side. And the retest is going to be the squat. So you should be able to get lower in your squat before you lose that neutral spine. Okay? So give it a try this week and let me know how it goes.